Hi, I'm Mandy. This video is basically just designed for you to get an understanding about me and what we're gonna be doing with your athletes. So, I wanted to take a few moments just to talk to you guys about me and my background and how I came to this incredible program. So, I started dancing. I walked into my first dance studio at age 10 and it was at that moment that my life completely changed. I used dance for so many different reasons and purposes um, to escape my home life, to allow me the opportunity to really fully express myself, both artistically and just as a performer, someone who just loves being on stage. That was a wonderful outlet for me. And to work work out like it was a great way for me to stay fit as a kid and I didn't even realize that I um, needed to have that as an outlet so I danced and was a cheerleader from the time I was age 10 until 18 when I turned 18 I was invited to audition for the largest dance um, camp company in the world. I was very, very blessed to receive a position with that company as a summer instructor. That led on to being a head instructor, a choreographer for the company for 20 years, um, as well as a territory manager. I was a judge for the national championships for over a decade, and it was an incredible experience to meet people and network all over the country. After a period of time doing that, I was able to shift and begin working as a consultant for the worldwide governing body for cheerleading and it's called performance cheer as an Olympic sport. Performance cheer really refers to what you would traditionally see as your, your dance teams, college and high school dance teams. So I started consulting with the governing body called the International Cheer Union and that was an incredible experience of being able to travel all over the world and help countries develop the sport of cheer and performance cheer because it is, after all, a sport that is native to the United States and is female driven. There are over 10 million athletes that do this sport worldwide and it is all because of the International Cheer Union that it's possible. So that's a very exciting piece. Um, so during this time, I was teaching camp both at the high school level and at the collegiate level very intensively. I was judging events all over the country. I was judging national championships. Um, I was a choreographer for several different um, amazing programs. I was coaching teams, very high caliber teams um, at the University of Kansas, at William Jewell College, at Hawaii Pacific University in Honolulu and choreographing, like I said, many, many routines. So throughout the course of this transition and most specifically my time at Hawaii Pacific University, a very prestigious and fun, amazing experience, I started experiencing my own level of awareness of how this work impacts my body that's very it's incredibly fun but it can also be very stressful because it is um, you're just constantly in flux of um, how your season's gonna go how this and that and all of these different things impact your life so when I lived in Hawaii I knew that I wasn't planning to stay there for a long time and when I moved home I had put on quite a bit of weight and most of it was due to stress because it also presented as just really painful acne. Okay, very painful acne, a high level of stress, a lot of extra weight, cortisol buildup, what, whatever you'd like to call it. Um, so it was at that time when I moved back to Kansas City that I decided I'm gonna try yoga. I'm stressed, I'm overweight, so what better way to work all this out than through a hot yoga class? And I just discovered Bikram yoga at the time. It was a 90 minute set sequence, very militant, there was no music. It was, you're standing, you're doing postures, and you're literally dumping sweat out. I loved it. As a, um, as a dancer, 
the discipline of that practice was so good for me and so much like it was so much fun for me to be in a just a silent environment and just sweating it out um, so after two years of that practice I got my yoga certification in 2010 and started practicing teaching uh, when I shifted focus into a vinyasa style and vinyasa is more of a dancey flow con connected movement it's very powerful practice as well and understood how to use my breath everything transformed so the weight and the acne all of those things sloughed off as i learned to really trust my breath and work it out through that sweat and what i'll describe later on as alchemy inner alchemy all of this time that was passing as i was practicing the yoga getting certified teaching i was still very actively involved in the dance community however my perspective had shifted i started noticing how much that the process of judging and the panels on which i was working were affecting my ability to speak my my personal perspective and to give the athletes credit and feedback to help them grow and oftentimes it it filtered out from other entities as criticism and really harsh judgment and that continued to evolve even further and further um, until I recognized that because I was still in very much practicing with my body and a lot of the people on these panels were not, they were no longer working with their body, they were no longer actively engaged with the sport it was coming out as a very strong judgment on the kids really as a reflection of their own lack of a continuous training regimen so it was at that point i had a spiritual awakening really started to dive deep into how the mind and the body work as one and how we disconnect from the two oftentimes in order to survive it's a survival mechanism, okay? So, enter COVID. <laughs> so, in 2020, obviously we all had a dramatic life shift, and at that point, I said, what am I gonna do now? What now? And the universe provided me a wonderful algorithm into the world of hypnotherapy. And hypnotherapy is the hypnotherapy that I practice is called Rapid Transformational Therapy. And this therapy is an incredible tool and vehicle to move you forward very quickly to transform your mind and to create new neural pathways in your mind rapidly. So it takes the best pieces of classical hypnotherapy, of cognitive behavioral therapy, of neuro-linguistic programming, and of like just classic counseling therapy into this one incredible method that I am presenting for your athletes. And optionally for you as well, if you're interested in working one-on-one -on -one with me, we do have one-on-one -on -one programs. So, Rapid Transformational Therapy by Marissa Peer is, it has been utterly life-changing for me, not only in my mind, in my physical body, and in the way that I have perceived everything happening, I am able to transform and help others so much. It is time for us to uplift humanity not to criticize, not to judge, but to allow all of those blockages in your mind from whether it's childhood experiences, whether it's past life experiences, RTT will uncover all of that. RTT is one part of the alchemical process of alchemy. So we work with the mind, we work with the body. So we will be doing body work in the form of yoga and the form of actual like 
working out pieces and parts of your body where you have stuck energy physically, that will, again, help you, your body and your mind to communicate with one another more effectively. We work with your heart through meditation, through journaling, and we really work with your soul to bring all of that together. So this is an incredible program for athletes to really, really zone in and work through whatever's going on in their own personal mind that's blocking them from being able to connect with the greater whole. And then as we all take that transformation together, we are really, really taking a quantum leap with our programs forward to allow the best and most incredible versions of our programs to flourish. So, body, heart, mind, soul. That is the alchemical process by which we transform our entire programs. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to me via email at this email address right here, or you can give me a call, but I genuinely look forward to working with you and all of your athletes. Have a wonderful day. Namaste. So I wanted to create this intensive that harnessed my experience as a dance and a yoga teacher, a parent, a healer, and most importantly, a student of life. This passionate blend of everything that I am. This is alchemy. Yeah.